Hi guys. In this video, we will learn how to sum our numbers based on the total number of our digits. Okay. Uh, the question actually sent to me by someone that if we have this kind of a problem, uh, how can we go about it? Uh, for instance, now let's assume that I want to sum uh, all the hundreds. Okay, the hundred. Okay, you know in our primary school store we have a uh, uh, tenth unit, hundred thousand, hundred thousand, and so on and so forth. But here now, uh, what we want to solve let uh, is based on hundred. Okay, and how are we going to do that? It's very simple, and that is why we usually say as an analyst you have to think. Okay, your thinking operation must be very high to achieve uh, this kind of a problem. I'm going to combine three functions here so as to achieve uh, the objective. Now, just say equal to, then sum. That's the first thing I want to sum something. Okay, then I have to make use of our conditional statement. Okay, if, if what, okay, then I'll make use of another particular function in Microsoft Excel which is referred to as len and what len will do is that it will count the number of uh, character of each of these number for me then if you uh, leave len okay if you count the number of this character len and all this from this down okay then uh, close it and it's equal to a uh, three you know the hundred is three okay three character sorry is equal to three okay then command command then what will happen sum this okay sum all this for me then I have to uh earphone it okay I have to add code it let me also add code this so that it will do it for uh, all of them okay let me add code it then from here now then if this requirement this condition is not met then what we do for me just return empty cell okay empty cell then close the bracket then this is an array because it's going to look into many things within this uh, column then you will now press ctrl shift and enter at the same time then click on yes to have it and i have 3161 and let's try this uh, manually and see maybe we, we get the same result is equal to okay the, the first one is 100 shift plus okay then uh this is another one plus this is another one plus this is another 100 plus this is another one plus this is another one plus last one here okay then enter can you see that i have the same result that is how you can achieve this you cannot make use of some if a some if as as a separate function because if you want to do that and you want to say that anything that is greater than 99 you know that anything that's greater than 99 is 100 and above okay but it will include all this thousand to hit and as a result of that this is the perfect uh function combinations uh, which you can use to achieve this objective you can use this uh, method to achieve many things based on the problem before you i believe that you have learned uh, another new concept uh, in microsoft excel here okay if you enjoyed the video and you find it useful uh, please ensure that you subscribe to my youtube channel so that immediately we upload new content then uh, you will get a notification thank you i may your you bye bye see you next time bye for now